to properly cross the road. Throughout this video, we will learn the importance of crossing the road, signs to look for and what they mean, and the five steps of crossing the road. So why do we need to learn the skill of crossing the street? Learning to cross the street is important for us to stay safe and healthy. By learning the rules of crossing the road, we can eliminate accidents from happening. Signs and what they mean. So at the crosswalk, you will either see a walk or a hand sign. This is the walk sign, and the walk sign means that it is okay to cross the road. Here is what a hand sign looks like. The hand sign means that you need to stop and wait on the sidewalk before crossing. When the hand sign is flashing with numbers, it is telling you how many more seconds you have to walk before it is unsafe to cross. Here is a crosswalk button. When you push it, it signals that someone is waiting to cross the street. Press the button and wait to see the walk sign before crossing. Crosswalks are marked with stripes of yellow or white lines across the road. They designate the areas that allow for pedestrians to cross. There are five steps to crossing the road. The first step is to choose a destination to walk to by foot. Once you do that, locate a crosswalk. Step two is to push the crosswalk button. After that, step three is to stop at the end of the sidewalk and look for the hand or walk signal. Step four is to check surroundings before crossing the street. And the final step, when all surroundings are clear and the walk sign is showing, is to cross the street. So here is what the steps look like with pictures. The first step is to choose a destination to walk to and locate a crosswalk. Once you find the crosswalk, wait at the end of the sidewalk like the boys in the photo, and then proceed with the next crosswalk safety steps. After completing step one, step two is to press the cross button and wait for the next step. The third step is to wait and look for the walk sign to appear. Once the sign appears, you can proceed with the next step. After the walk sign appears, you should check all surroundings. You can do this by looking for oncoming cars and looking both ways before crossing the road. After you have checked your surroundings and the walk sign is present, you may safely cross the road by walking in between the marked crosswalk lines. So make sure you are staying safe and checking all surroundings before ever crossing the street. Follow these five steps of locating a crosswalk and waiting at the edge of the sidewalk, pressing the cross button, waiting for the correct walk signal, check all surroundings, and then use the crosswalk correctly to ensure you are safe. 